Hello everyone, welcome back to Infigyan. Today in this video, we are going to take up another very very interesting question from radical expressions. Here we have to simplify the given expression without using a calculator. So let's get started by considering this expression equal to e first. Now we can write e equal to square root of square root of 2 power 7 times 2 power 8 we can write 2 power 2 times 4 plus 2 power 4 times 4 plus 12 power 4 then minus 12 cube is there which will be equal to square root of square root of 2 power 7 then I can write 2 power 2 times 4 as 2 power 2 and then whole power 4 using exponent laws I will write here 2 power 4 and then whole power 4 then we have 12 power 4 minus 12 cube this will be equal to square root of square root of 2 power 7 in the bracket 2 square this is 4 2 power 4 this is 16 so I will write here 4 power 4 plus 16 power 4 plus 12 power 4 and then minus 12 cube. Now I will use substitutions. Let me write expression once e equal to square root of square root of 2 power 7 in the bracket 4 power 4 plus 12 power 4 plus 16 power 4 minus 12 cube. Now I will consider let 4 equal to a, 12 equal to b. So 16 will be a plus b, 4 plus 12. So our expression will become the square root of the square root of I will retain 2 power 7 as it is in the bracket I can write 4 as a so a power 4 12 as b so b power 4 16 as a plus b so I can write a plus b whole power 4 and then minus 12 cube I can write minus 12 times 12 is square. Now 12 is b. So b is square will be 12 is square. So here I can write this is b is square. Now I will use binomial expansion a plus b whole power 4. Let me write here expression e equal to square root of the square root of 2 power 7 in the bracket a power 4 plus b power 4 plus a plus b whole power 4 so i will write the expansion directly so i will write a power 4 plus b power 4 plus 4 a cube b plus 4 a b cube plus 6 times a square b square and then I will write minus 12 b square. Now you can see I can take 2 common in the bracket or from the bracket so I will get a square root of a square root of I will write here 2 power 7 and then I will write times 2 which is common from the bracket. So I can write a power 4 
plus b power 4 plus 2a cube b plus 2ab cube plus 3a square b square. Now this is there minus 12b square. Now I will split 3a square b square as a square b square plus 2a square b square. So let us write here. I will write a square root of a square root of so 2 power 7 times 2. We can write 2 power 8 in the bracket. I will write a power 4 as a square whole square b power 4 as b square whole square. Then I will consider this term a square b square. So I can write a b whole square. Now I will consider our second term 2 a square b square the split of 3 a square b square. So I will write here 2 times a square times b square. Now I will consider 2a b cube term. So I will write 2 times b square times a b. This is 2a b cube. Then I will consider 2a cube b. So I will write 2 times a b times a square. After that, we are having minus 12b square. Now you can see the radicant part is one perfect square, this segment only. So this is, if I will write pqr, then I can write here p square plus q square plus r square plus 2pq plus 2qr plus 2rp. This will be equal to p plus q plus r whole square. So I can write this is a square plus b square plus ab whole square. I can write expression e equal to the square root of the square root of 2 power 8. Then in bracket I will write this is a square plus b square plus a b whole square and then we will write minus 12 b square. Now I will cancel this square root with the powers. So let me write here a square root of I will write a square root of 2 power 8. This will be equal to 256. So I can write this is 16 whole a square. And then I will write a square plus b square plus ab whole a square. Then we have minus 12b square. Now I can write a square root of a square root of 16 in bracket a square plus b square plus a b and then whole square. Then we have minus 12 b square. Now we can cancel a square root with a square. So I can write here a square root of 16 in the bracket a square plus b square plus a b and then minus 12b square. Now we have to expand this. Let's multiply 16 in the bracket. So I will write 16a square plus 16b square plus 16ab. Let me write square root of 16a square plus 16b square plus 16ab minus 12b square. This is our required expression E. 
Now 16b square minus 12b square. We will write the square root of 16a square plus 16 minus 12, 4. So 4b square plus 16ab. Now this we can write 16, 4a square. So I will write this is 4a whole a square. 4b square. Can we write 2b whole a square? Plus 16ab. I can write 2 times 4a times 2b. So it is recalling if I will write m square plus n square plus 2mn. Then this is formula for m plus n whole square. So I can write our expression e equal to square root of, I will write 4a plus 2b whole square. Now we can cancel a square root with this square. So our expression will become 4a plus 2b. 4a plus 2b. Now a was 4, b was 12. So we can get our expression value 4 times 4 as 4a plus this is 2 times b. So I will write 2 times b is 12. So this will give us 16 plus 24 which is equal to 40. So our final answer becomes e equal to 40. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to subscribe our channel. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye-bye.